Okay, here we go. What's going on, y'all? Welcome to another installment of The Heathen's Haven. I am your host, the head heathen, unsane, the plaster bastard. Back again with another motherfucking episode of the podcast with my boy here. Abstract was really good. Right. Right. Crackers. Whole ass niggas. <laughs> Simp ass niggas. Oh man, I'm gonna start on the stamps. Shit, I got a couple simps. I got a simp story to tell you too. I'm gonna save it for a little bit later on, man, because I think it'll make a good segue into the main topic. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah. How everything been going, man? Uh, all right. Shit, forties is already feeling forty. <laughs> she had to take the fuck a week off from the gym because everything was starting to fucking hurt. Warming up. I'm like, ah, no, nah, my knee hurt, my fucking shoulder hurt, my arm hurt. I'm like, you know what? I need a break. Bro. All that shit catching up with your old ass. <laughs> right, I, I go to the gym five days a week. You know what I mean? So it's like that shit just taking the toll. So I just took this whole week off playing video games and shit, just chilling. I think all that goddamn walking I did when I was younger took a toll on my legs. Shit, I should be aching like a motherfucker sometimes. Man, ain't it crazy how, um, like 20 years ago, shit, for me, 10 years ago, but 20 years ago. Hell, one year ago, shit. I wasn't <laughs> no, just fucked up. When you felt like, it's really a teen, the early 20s, when you felt damn that indestructible. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, man, I miss the day that's just, I used to hoop for like two hours, break down for three hours. And then go and eat like a extra value meal, ass and all types of shit. Like it's crazy. Yeah, metabolism ain't even the same no more. Fuck no. Your ass man. gotta, yeah, you gotta jog that shit off immediately. Yeah, yeah. As soon as you eat it. I my calories. Nigga. On the real, you gotta count that shit. <laughs> man. Like, man, what did I eat earlier? Really? I didn't eat some fruit or some shit. <laughs> right. Oh, God, I can't even eat this fucking cracker because I did all my fucking deficit. But dog, but I'm like, dude. Like an extra value bill, niggas. I know y'all niggas. Y'all know y'all niggas remember that shit. I couldn't live like that, bro. But now, hell no. No, I mean like having to count all my goddamn calories oh, and shit. Oh, oh shit, nigga. Shit, having a it. having a fucking hell no. I hell. had to do it. it. My thing was, man. I'm like forty. I gotta be. I gotta be on my shit, man. Cause it's only getting harder from here. Oh, oh yeah. Shit, it's three years ago, but it's really getting hard. Oh yeah. So. Yeah, man. Shit, like I said, man, I can barely walk sometimes. Though. That shit be hurting like a motherfucker. Man, you Damn. saw me get off the fucking chair like ah. Get <laughs> out of bed like ah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. I'm like, god damn, dog. And then I got a, and then I got a job where I got to be on my feet all day, so that don't help. Yeah, I see. I just sit down. And shit. <laughs> shit. I wish I could sit my ass down sometimes. Shit. That's a, that's a bad thing. At COVID, that's the best thing that happened. Something, well, from COVID was working from home, nigga. Like, yeah, you know, yeah. Like, nigga, I guess I wake up at, at seven o'clock, sit in bed, lay in bed, and then log in at seven thirty. <laughs> Go watch TV. Yeah, and start working around nine o'clock, nigga. <laughs> and then take a nap around one o'clock. Like this is fuck. And I'm not, they not even like checking to see if I'm working. Like, <laughs> I'm like, man, I got it, man. I ain't going nowhere. Man. I said, I'm visiting your cubicle and shit. Yeah, like, I don't know. <laughs> or, or, you know, some just like my, uh, my girl, her job got it where they want to see movement. Like, they think you ain't doing shit. They might have been like, oh, you slacking. You get docked for that. Oh, fuck y'all. At the end of the day, when I log in, I don't do shit. Like, tomorrow, I ain't doing shit tomorrow, nigga. <laughs> I play all these games with this ball. I got Mortal Kombat 11. That shit fire. Oh, like, yeah, I bet. Yo, that shit fire. Oh, man. That's a, uh, let me see. The story don't make sense to me because I'm thinking I shot really play Mortal Kombat since that Mortal Kombat you had. Oh, for real? Damn, that was like... <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah, at least. That was the one for 60, uh, 360, man. So I don't even know what the story is. Like, shit ain't making sense. Yeah, these graphics and something else, though. Mm-hmm. 
I ain't fucking, fucking around with these graphics. graphics. I ain't. Yeah, spine on there. Yo, you see Dope on there. Uh, yeah. Shit, man. I see. Let me see. I'm trying to see what else they got on there, but I can't see the fucking pictures. God damn it. I see they still got my boy Kung Lao on there. What the fuck? Yeah. It's looking to me like, um, Remember Mortal Kombat trilogy when they threw everybody in that motherfucker? Yeah. Like they doing that. Like the story don't make like the main character is uh is uh Johnny Cage and uh Sonya playing Blade's daughter. Is that her right there? Uh let me see. Yeah. Is, is that, that Kano? Kano? Uh yeah. Yeah. Well whoa. That's what I was in the movie. Oh, so is this even real? Shit, that ain't from the movie. movie. What well, movie, though? From the movie, man. You didn't see the movie? From uh, the one on HBO? Yeah. Hell no. Nah. You never saw it? What do you wait? See, oh, damn. You want to go review? I want to review that, man. Shit, there's too many motherfuckers mixed reviews on that shit. I ain't into it. What you think about the first one? The original? Yeah. It was good for the time. I can't watch it now. It worked. It's, it's, it's a, a bad, bad movie. movie. <laughs> but as far as, it's a video game movie, so you gotta put those in a different. Yeah, you know, I mean, I mean, come on, man. Why does every video game movie have to be bad? Because they gotta base it on the video game instead of the original content. That is a, that is original content. What do you mean? But it's based on the games, so they have to be as close to the game as possible. Yeah, but they don't. They don't ever do it though. What's a decent name? A decent video game movie. Uh, well, most of them sucked. I know it was at least one. Yeah, but think of how, with a book, look how much fucking, look how much source material you have. Yeah, I get it, but you still got a lot of source material with the game because you got a story that's built behind that too. And even if it ain't, you could make one up, shit, and at least have it be more like the game. What the fuck do you want to do? Not really. Because they're going to be like, oh, what about this? And why? Because I think the difference is from a movie, a, book, a movie based on a book and a movie based on a video game, one is budget. And then two, you want to see shit based off a game that really the story, the story already shaped his fuck. <laughs> but a book, you got to think like a book, like a uh, clear and print. And present danger. danger yeah. Big ass book. Yeah. You got plenty of shit to talk about. Shit, most of the time, because shit out the fucking the movie, but the book's so fucking big. Yeah. The yeah. Sand. And it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Fucking off. But I love, you know what? Uh, that's why I'm going to start. I'm going to start. I'm never going to watch a movie based off a book without reading the book. Shit, half, half the time, time I don't even know it's based, based off a book. book. That's the hard part, too. Because when I found I, uh, the Green Mile, I bought the audio book. Right. I ain't got time for that shit, bro. <laughs> so then I listened to it at work. And I'm like, I'm not going to watch this fucking movie until I see it. And it was rewarded because you see the shit going on and you see what they left out. Right. So that's dope. It wasn't like how motherfuckers be, especially the comic book geeks. Well, in the comic, I hate them. <laughs> it's not like when, oh you so mad that this one left out it's like oh well I get it you can't just throw all this shit at me alright I don't know three hour movie two and a half hour movie so yeah but video games on the high top of that shit I think the best video game movie I ever saw is Sonic 2 <laughs> I never so, saw it it's very good it's very good <laughs> Yeah, people tell me it's good, but I ain't, I can't get through the first one, so fuck them. I tried to watch that shit. I, I cut that shit off after like a minute and a half. I tell you a fucking video game movie I like, and motherfuckers hating on, Resident Evil Apocalypse. Shit, I don't think I saw that one. Because I was done with it after the first movie. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't blame you because I hated that. I'm going to see that shit with Jill. I'm like... This movie, we. That ain't got nothing to do with the game at all, bro. But the second one is straight fan service, though. All everybody with the uh, Resident Evil was in that motherfucker. Actual zombies, fucking uh, nemesis ass. 
Mm. Like, all types of shit. Jill Valentine. Like, motherfuckers who actually in the fucking video game was in the movie. Yeah, yeah. I love it. That's what, that, that's what fucking video game movies should be about. Fan service. Don't expect in this story. Oh, shit. I mean, yeah. But yeah, I mean, look at the Mario Brothers, Brothers movie, movie, though. Uh, 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 I mean, should we go there? Man? I mean, yeah, like, can we go there? Like, that shit yeah. didn't have nothing to do with the movie. At all. Nothing. And, and dude, I was much of a fucking Mario stand that I tried justifying it. Man, you was bogus for that shit, dog. Tr- dude, I tried. Like, I remember, I remember watching that shit. Like, I didn't see it in the movie theater, but when that shit hit HBO, I'm sitting there like, I'm trying, fam. I'm trying. And and the best thing of a best thing now is find out what really happened. Like the nigga who played Mario was on coke and <laughs> day. I would have been too if I was part of I would have been too if I was part of that weak ass movie. Yeah, shit. Like, <laughs> run out of money. Yeah, because he's drinking, drinking and coke it all up. <laughs> like you sniffing up the budget, nigga. Fat motherfucker, go get some some motherfucking Xanax. They're supposed to be coming out with another one um, this year, late this year or early next year. Why? It's a joke. But it's not like that. I think it's kind of animated. You ever saw um, Professor? uh, Yeah, Professor Pikachu or Detective Pikachu? What? No. I'm trying to say where. Like Alvin and the Chipmunk scene, where which what are you talking about? Dog? You know how with Alvin and the Chipmunk movie, where they're actually they're CGI in the real world. I think that's what it's gonna be like. Oh, okay. So kind of like, like Who Framed Roger, Roger Rabbit type yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, now so I get it. That could work. That could work. It could if, if they, they do it right. right. They have to do it right there, because they get, man, come on, man. Who Framed Roger Rabbit came out in 1988, 87 or some shit. Hey, you, you can't do a better job than them. You just need to hang it up, motherfucker, because ain't nobody you fucking, it ain't no excuse for that shit. Yeah, especially now that Mario has actual deep source material. Yeah, exactly. They gave it to him over 30 years of the games. Like, you got come on. Damn, Damn, y'all got, got shit to work with. Work, work with it. it. But how would it work? Is it just Mario? I'm thinking like, what was it? It's like Mario was in the, the 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 Mushroom Kingdom and he went down the pipe, and now he's in there. The Koopa brought Princess Toadstool in the real world. I'm like, like yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna let it ride. I'm gonna see what the, what it's all about. I got you got faith, huh? Himself, you got faith. <laughs> That's fair enough. They gotta redeem themselves. They better. That was bullshit. Ain't nobody forgot that. You know what I'm saying? That movie was terrible. I remember sitting there watching it like, yo, what the fuck this got to do? You want to know what a video game movie was really terrible? Street Fighter. That was so bad, it was good. Oh my God, good out. What I mean good is... I think with Mortal Kombat, I expected... More. What? When I expected more than Street Fighter, if that makes sense. You got more than Street Fighter. Street Fighter didn't want shit. I don't know how the fuck is Guy. I fucking Austrian and shit. But <laughs> but that was a whole Idaho red blooded white motherfucker. That's an American. <laughs> He's from America. Wait, like, like it's so bad because when I watch it, I'm not. Trying it's all about entertainment. Fuck this story. The story don't make no fucking sense at all. And rule Julia made the props to him because damn he was fighting cancer during the fucking movie. During the shoot. Yep. Damn. Who was? Rule of Raw Julia. Oh, Raw Julia. Yeah. Shit, yeah. Didn't he pass away from that shit? Yeah. Like shortly after that movie yeah. came out? That's, man. And he said he only did it because his son went in the play. Like she thought it was his favorite video game and shit. Yeah. He, like he did it for the son. That's what's up. That's some stand up shit. Yeah, 
Some stand, stand up, up nigga shit, shit right there. Right. <laughs> yeah, it was. But I, 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 I would literally look for it and watch it. I wouldn't. You know what I mean? Like, like it's one of the movies. It's what it is. It's one of the movies where you put it on and then you start doing other shit, like playing on your laptop. That's ridiculous. It's you also start cleaning your house and shit. Not, not that. You don't mean not that bad. <laughs> but the one of the movies you put on and it's like shit. All right, well. Is there? I know how. Look when I'm glad I look. Da, 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 da. I would never go to the movie theater and see this shit. Hell no. No. Shit, when we were trying, trying to go see, see, I remember my brother-in-law tried to take me to go see uh, Mortal Kombat. He thought it was gonna be at the budget. <laughs> it first came out and shit like, he's like, it ain't gonna be at no budget, dog. They show old movies. Hell, movie worked in the fucking Mortal Kombat. I mean, um, Street Fighter was Mortal Kombat Annihilation. The actors didn't even like that thing. It was so bad, Johnny Cage demanded he get killed. That's why the last the first fucking two minutes of the movie. Johnny Cage wanted to die off in the movie. Yeah, that's why he died. Wait, he was in that movie for two minutes. In the first one? Second. I was gonna say he lasted Annihilation. 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 Oh, I never saw that one. Don't! <laughs> Man, no. Not even for entertainment. That, that is kind of, that would be for content purposes, don't <laughs> Only! <laughs> yeah, we might have to do that one. Once I get this goddamn editing software acting right. Man, I wonder if we could, you think it would be legal to live stream that? What? Cause I would love to see a live stream watching that movie. I mean, we, we can do, do it, but we just can't show none of it. Ah, damn. Damn. Because what if we just delete the live stream then? I mean, yeah, yeah I, I guess that'll delete. work, but yeah, that'll work, but still. Yeah. But yeah, but like, like I think if we had, if we had enough you know, followers and shit, that we can hit the live stream. Then people saw it and then we deleted it after. Hell yeah. I, would, I wanted to see, and I want them to see your live reaction to that fucking movie. What, Annihilation? Yeah. <laughs> no, I want like, to watch some bullshit. This ain't going to be no acting in this thing. Okay, act like that. No, everything, this is going to be straight raw. Oh yeah, they already know. I mean, they, anybody that saw it, they saw my old reaction videos, you know. But anyway, now that we have got the music and shit playing in the background, it's time for me to spark up the devil lettuce. Cause the heathen's haven. This is not the heathen's haven without a blunt of the devil lettuce. I thought this motherfucker wasn't gonna spark at first. I was gonna be mad. Like, damn, that's embarrassing. I hate this auxiliary cord. I would just like to say that. You want to family dog? Yeah, you know what? I meant to do that today, but I ain't have enough cash on me. They don't ever, they don't ever have a car machine working on regular ass store. Shit, trash. I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of this ghetto nigga shit. I want to get up out of this motherfucker, dog, and stay out. I mean, guys, who's on the old spot? I mean, we're going on the whole summer. I don't fucking know, dog. No, back in shit. God, mother. Right? <laughs> I'm just going to go there and see what's up. I'm just scared to shit. This shit can't be the motherfucker. I'll be pissed. <laughs> yeah, what are y'all? I'm, I'm not giving you, uh, I'm $200 short for that rent because y'all got to pay me for that TV. <laughs> oh, shit. Fuck that shit. Yeah, fuck that. Maybe let's might break into an abandoned house. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I would have got my camera and shit. Shit, that was like what a month ago. That was the last time I went and got. Now I've been to the house. I ain't been there since. 
Oh, I don't know what the fuck going on with that shit. It's a mess. Oh, shit. I need to hit up a brewer game, man, before the summer over. At least I wanted to. Did you, have you been to one? No, I'm going, um... Me and my bro, we go, um... Uh, for the Dodgers. Oh, okay. Y'all Dodger, Dodger fans, fans, nigga? Huh? Y'all Dodger, Dodger fans? fans? Oh, I am. Oh, you are? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, well, we, we, try to, we got the grill working. I don't understand how the fuck you can't get the grill working. I don't fucking know. Like, it should be signs like, I, I clicked it out. It's clean. The charcoal okay. is good. And it's, it's still all light. light. It will light, but then it's going to die quick. It don't hold. Open, so all the shit coming out, I keep that shit up. No way, you believe it. Open. I'm supposed to leave it open so it can feed the fire, fool. <laughs> <laughs> the bottom, the bottom one, though, the bottom one, the bottom one. What bottom one? The yeah, one that the you have is a bottom, like, kind of a, a opening. Underneath it? On the side of it. Open that shit, bro. That's how all the air gets to the fire. Fire any oxygen too, nigga. But that I'm telling, but I'm saying, even if I leave it open, he said you. So even if you leave it open, you still can't keep the fire going. Yes. Maybe it's your cheap ass charcoals. Nigga, this is fucking uh, what's the name? This ain't that cheap. This ain't Walmart. This ain't the Walmart shit. This ain't charcoal. This is that good shit. Oh, that, so I don't know, man. I, I don't think, think you know what the fuck you're doing. I think it's my fucking grill. I'm going to go, I'm going to barbecue. It can't be the grill, dog. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll barbecue sometime. Um, probably this weekend. Damn, that's not. Damn, that's not. Like, do we want to go to a bar for all that money? Shit, barbecue that shit yourself. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, no, so I'm gonna test it out. And if I get the shit work again, yeah, we're gonna take it. I don't wanna take that grill. We took the grill before and the shit wasn't working. And we ain't here befriending motherfuckers trying to use any grill this shit. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Shit, don't nobody wanna be a parasite. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get your bum ass away from me, man. Why'd you bring all the fucking grill with you? <laughs> get the fuck up out of here, nigga. You didn't put it in on these coals, motherfucker. Straight up white dude talking to you like that. You didn't put a bit of them motherfucking coals, nigga. Me? Fucking crap is supposed to be friendly. Like we are until you start trying to use our shit without permission. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny as hell. Oh, for good over there talking like, yeah, yeah, they're gonna go all the way. <laughs> yeah, all right. hey, yeah, let me put my steak over here. See, what the fuck you think you're doing, nigga? This motherfucker, nigga, put it on these motherfucking coals, nigga. So it sounded like, uh, they were on Boondocks, but, uh, old boy, the niggas, uh, went to his nephew and shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's all it's Samuel Jackson and shit. <laughs> Like, damn, what the fuck? <laughs> straight up older white dude, too. With a straight dad bot. <laughs> Grilling burgers and shit. Turned his back for a second, like, yeah, go home, Billy! Let's <laughs> <laughs> around. He's like, what the fuck you think you're doing, nigga? Ain't <laughs> no motherfucking joke, nigga. Get the fuck away from my motherfucking grill, nigga. You ain't putting it on these coals, nigga. <laughs> like, damn. <laughs> Send you the fuck out your fingertips like men in black. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, man. Man, what the fuck? Oh, man, the bitch, man. Uh, The bitch, the WNBA bitch. Oh, Brandy Grind hit with nine joints. Nine years, dog. That bitch got nine motherfucking bullets. Oh, that's fucked, fucked up. up. For we know, damn, damn Russia, Russia is strict, dog. They don't play that shit. Like, you, you, you will be cold and miserable so like the rest of us. You so, uh, uh, what do you call, uh, locked up abroad? This bitch didn't see that shit? Guess not. She was too busy. 
playing, playing basketball, basketball and shit, you know, missing shots. Oh, <laughs> 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 here's the funny part. Is the motherfuckers and the chicks talking about, well, if, if, if men watch WNBA, she wouldn't be doing this. Like, Shut the fuck, fuck up, up bitch. bitch. Why are you watching that? Right, you watch that shit. Why the, the fuck we gotta watch it? We, we don't need, we don't like the shit because it's weak. Yeah. All right. If it, if they was doing some shit on there, like actually making some shots and actually dunking or something, I mean, y'all got big, tall, ugly, manly looking ass bitches like Brittany Griner on there, but for what reason? She can't do shit. I mean, she can't dunk. She can't. But she can dunk. She can dunk. But she ain't playing that hoe. She just doing that sexual living dunking. Oh man, fuck out. They ain't dunking. <laughs> I don't count. But uh, these hoes missing layups, bro. Like, like ain't nobody like, trying to fucking watch that shit. The thing, though, once again, is women don't want accountability. Right, like, y'all, y'all should be supporting this shit. shit. <laughs> yeah. Right, exactly. Shit, so y'all the feminists. Thing, we, we gave them a lead. Right, and y'all, Beyonce just dropped an album last week and it went uh, platinum. Yeah, yeah. Beyonce just dropped an album last week and it yeah. When y'all sitting there talking all this girl power shit, when y'all like, when y'all support somebody, y'all put y'all money to it. But y'all can't support women, and don't give a fuck about women so much, y'all be watching the WNBA to make sure they ain't gotta go overseas. But y'all don't want y'all to put the blame on us for some shit that we don't even watch. And right. that one of these bitches, took, that one of these bitches took, can sit there and be like, but that's like, why ain't y'all watching? Well, why ain't y'all watching? We ain't watch that shit. Right. Y'all girl power and feminists and then and then and then y'all watch that shit. Y'all gonna put money on Brianna, Beyonce, you know, whatever bitch, Megan Thee Stallion. Y'all put money in these bitches' pockets, but y'all wanna bitch and moan about some shit, just breaking ground. I don't give a fuck. Let that bitch ride. I don't give a fuck. Shouldn't took that shit over to Russia while we in the middle of a fucking war anyway. <laughs> right. So bitch learn some Russian. And eat quiet, got to eat quiet, and back just in there all the time. Yeah, and, and they, they like a, and, and they like, a, and they like a strong face bitch like, like you. You know what I'm saying? A bitch that ain't got no, a bitch that look like a straight up dude. Like if Biden ain't doing shit, here's the thing. Biden just begging. That's all he's doing. If, if Biden, Biden is fucking pump faking. But like Dawson is talking about, oh, this is a fucking unjust yeah, punishment. And, Hold your head. Like, how the fuck you gonna try and sit up there and tell another motherfucking country what the fuck, fuck is fair? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And they land and they laws. No, a lot of balls. Bro, Russia said, alright, listen here. Give us this nigga over here and this nigga over here and we'll give you this bitch. And, bro, and we still ain't get it. So they don't give a fuck. They, they, they think like, all right, this nigga they want is a big arms killer. But this bitch, this ain't LeBron, man. Soldier head. Soldier head. Oh, so this ain't LeBron. Soldier head. That nigga don't give a fuck. If he did, if he gave a fuck, why would he even be going to trial? He's either been there. I hear take that nigga. I said, I said, that nigga went for this shit to die out and nigga go. Right, I'm finna fucking, I'm finna raise hell upon this motherfucking earth, man. <laughs> That's what he's talking about, nigga. Shit, Biden too. Fuck it. Biden's like, man, what is this? Nah, ain't nobody watching there. I don't watch her. I don't even know who the hell she was until I, I heard this story or whatever, and until I had a. Uh, Kamala read it to me. Oh man, the sad thing happened to Britney Spears. Britney Spears. She uh keep her mind and body up. Oh yeah. Um, you mean Griner, motherfucker? Oh wait, sorry. Oh yeah, you're right. It's not her. It's the manly looking bitch. Yeah, Dawson, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, we're rolling. <laughs> like shit, man. Hey, well, man, they ain't give a fuck about her, dog. They ain't. Not, 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 it wouldn't take this long. Yeah. It would not take this long. Now the bitch got to do nine years in a Russian prison. Nine years. You did not think it would be motherfucking years. 
just off the strength of, I'm like, dog. They only want the drive to you sitting there. They, they, they like, you ain't, you ain't gonna send out our nigga? You not gonna send our nigga back? Oh, that I ain't gonna try. Hit that bitch with the max. We're, We're changing to- people's <laughs> lives. <laughs> Hit that bitch. So, so. Cause, cause, I'm like, how the fuck you gonna give you a motherfucking favor? And you sitting the motherfuckers, you sitting in brackets and millions of things and all to the, the country we trying to make. If you, if I bet you if she was one of them pretty white girls, he'd have sent at least one of them tax suckers on, on back there with her. <laughs> bet you. I bet you. Right. True. True. At least right. one. Right. Shit. Right. But I'm like, you doing all this shit in war and these states send all this money and missiles and rockets and planes and fucking big and enemy. Hold your head. Going to, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, hold your do head, prison, Brittany. Do the prison, do the prison shit. Basketball league. Hell yeah, if they, they got, got one. But think about it, she's seven feet. Just run that motherfucker. Shit, there's probably some seven foot bitches in there. <laughs> it's Russia. It's Russia. It's hard. It's just one foot every day in their life. Bunch of bricks. Oh, man, she's too <laughs> Bunch of, bunch of igloos. Can't even fuck what you gonna do. Can't fuck nobody. In Soviet <laughs> Russia. <laughs> like damn, dog. Yeah, there's some big bitches in there. Right. And she's and she kind of scrawny too. She kind of lean. Yeah, yeah. Ox. I don't know what the fuck Russians eat. All fucking rabbits and shit. They just bite the fucking head off right all through the fucking fur. Yeah! They just eating Ukrainians and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, oh, he's about to get hacked. <laughs> On a real page, shut the fuck down. Like, oh, that was supposed to be funny, huh? Let's see how funny you think this shit is. <laughs> I said that. Type in the address and shit, like. That motherfucker gonna hit Family <laughs> Dollar <laughs> as it should. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucking bitch ass niggas. How the fuck they ain't never got their card machine working, dog? Nah. Go in there with a card, can't even use it. What's worse? Nah, but what's worse is anybody who sells shit and is only cash on it. Just like this. Like motherfucker in 2022, nigga, cash damn is thing. Yeah, yeah. I mean, not really. Cars. How the fuck you when we take that? Really? It's like ninety (laughs) five. That's because they they system always be down, dog. But they ain't working up the fucking skin shit. Got me a new wallet. That's flat. Hell yeah, a little money clip built (laughs) in. I wouldn't want it like that, I think, but when we press the button and the car just pop out. Yeah, that's, that's what, what I thought this fucking was. was. That's what I thought I bought, man. man. They played me, dog. Yeah, when I saw the other side, I'm like, oh, yeah, one of those things. Yeah, yeah they, they played, played me, bro. bro. They, they don't, don't pop, pop out. out. Bitch ass <laughs> niggas. <laughs> it's all good. I'll keep it. But when I upgrade, it better be the right goddamn wallet. I'm not playing no games with you, motherfuckers. Man, I lost my wallet on 27th National. Oh. And I'm like, oh, that bitch gone. <laughs> That's Hype City over there. <laughs> Dog, can you believe one of these motherfuckers actually took my wallet and gave it to the motherfucking uh, worker? Because I was, I was looking everywhere for my wallet. I was at the same moment. Little park, I was all over the motherfucker. Then I'm like, the next day I'm like, you know what, man? Let me just go see what's at Walmart. I mean, I'll walk. I know this thing here. So I'm like, y'all got my wallet. I mean, y'all, y'all see a wallet? But like, yeah, what it looks like. I'm like, oh shit. I'm like, da 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 yeah, somebody else side found it, brought it in. I'm like, god damn. Oh shit, you lucky. Because I'm up for it up. Yeah, I'm going I'm to have to take my ID out of my wallet. Really? Yeah, I, I, I don't carry my ID. Why? Just in case I lose my wallet. Oh. 
<laughs> plus, I don't need it. I don't, I don't use it every day. So it's part of the for. What I did, I, I, had, I bought this thing. It's um, like a towel, like a track, a home with a track in the pipe. So if I move my shit, I know where the fuck it is. Oh, that's dope. Where, where, where the fuck you get that from? That's hot. Like, like, I'm not worried of shit. This is oh, yeah. exactly to the fucking centimeter. Uh, it's right there <laughs> under the bed. This one, nigga, right there, nigga. It's you see it right, right, right here. Just punching the shit. Uh, take, take your wallet in, right. man. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Whole ass nigga, shit. Why the fuck, fuck you always got to lie? Oh man, dude. <sighs> I, I want, want to go to State, State Fair, Fair, man. man. Did we say that already? Nah, we said that off. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did want to go to State Fair. It was opening day today, too. Should go after the show. <laughs> Late as fuck. Get to a motherfucking ass out of this. Midnight. We closed, nigga. Fuck you thought this was. And it's going to be big ass crowd, too. It's opening day. I already know. I used to sell water out there. Make a killing. It's too many niggas. And white, white people. But how do you keep that shit cold? I know you got a cooler and all that. Cooler. But how do you read? Do you do you read? Uh, keep my nice. Okay. See, smart. These motherfuckers got here with this cooler that's down here since ten o'clock in the morning. Just sitting there with tepid water in it, like damn, nigga, nigga, you ain't using none of the money you made to go buy some motherfucking ice. Right. Lazy but bastard. It'd be like a a, a group of them. like it'd be somebody who go constantly and get ice. Shit, it was, it was just me, so it wasn't no choice. Shit, I had to keep. I remember when I was working Summerfest doing that shit. I had to work all the way. I had to run all the way back to fucking uh, what was that? Um, what's that supermarket? That fake ass pick and save? Metro Market. Metro Market. I had to keep running back there to get ice and water and shit. <laughs> I remember a lot of times, bro. I used to steal the ice. <laughs> like for real, like they had the ice machine outside the door. I'm like, shit. All right, yeah. All right, bye. Take a big ass bag of ice and shit on my way out the door. Fuck it. <laughs> they got hit to that shit. They was like, fuck that. <laughs> you gotta get it from inside now. Oh man. Yeah. See that's that's what that's how you Yeah, man. These kids be tripping me out doing that shit, dog. They uh like when I see them selling water, they always standing out on like a busy ass street in the median and shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like on the corner or some busy ass street. It's like, that ain't, you ain't gonna make no money like that. If you do, it's gonna come slow as fuck. Cause you, you need a lot of foot traffic for shit like that. You know what I'm saying? You can't just have like, you can't be standing on the corner and it's like cars zooming by like 60 miles per hour. I ain't finna stop about no motherfucking water from you, nigga. You got where the hot spot is that spot around the highway. What is that, Lisbon? It's not like you come like come from the south side and then you go up and then you know what I'm talking about, right? I, I don't I don't know. Where um I think it's Lisbon and something. Where uh that police station is but further down, like Garfield. Oh yeah. And um uh, if you get a stop sign there, a stop like this, so you gotta you gotta go like that. There's no foot traffic, but then you might yeah, you can. Yeah, I mean, I mean, when I was out there, I saw it to some people in, in traffic and shit, but not as much as I saw the people on foot. And it was a lot of them, so it was more cars than people. So you can't tell me. <laughs> shit, that's yeah, somebody, somebody, when doing that, also to add more shit like food. I was selling, I was selling chips. Come and see that store. <laughs> I was selling yeah, chips and chip, shit. Like, buy one, buy, you know me, buy a thing, get the chips for like 50 cents. No, I ain't that. Da, 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 da. So I know it's two for a dollar. Shit. I was out there, bro. On a bad day, I'd make like 200. God damn. Every and day. And why only what? Five dollars? But like a 24 pack. Shit, and I was buying the cheap shit. So it was like two, three dollars. <laughs> On the real, they thirsty, they thirsty. It was hot as hell too. Shit. I remember one time I was out there so long I got sunburn, bro. For real. 
Hell, I got sunburn, dog. I got a picture of him over that shit on my Facebook. My old one. That was like all up here and shit on my forehead and shit. I was like, damn, this shit. I ain't think that would happen to my black ass. <laughs> but yeah, don't put shit past you, man. You get that skin canceration too. <laughs> shit. Oh, water. I the patience. Yeah. It ain't gonna take long if you're in the right spot. But it's not. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, you're gonna be out in for a long ass, hot ass day then. <laughs> Shit. Fuck it. That's why I just only get up to festivals. That's why these motherfuckers, instead of these homeless niggas, instead of begging, like on 27th the fucking national. But these niggas got this shit so sort of, and a nigga over here, and then a nigga over there. <laughs> but y'all can literally just buy water in the fucking corner store is right there. Right. Team but up. You get more buck, you get more dollars off that and begging. Mm, hell yeah. But, man, I still, it's like this though. It's fam, if you I would I would give you money, more money, if you did something like told a joke, why don't you just sit on the corner and just tell jokes? Probably ain't funny, funny. shit. Are you hungry? Are you you wanna get high? You feeling? it? <laughs> I'm gonna you make a dolphin joke. You <laughs> wanna make a dolphin joke. You know what I mean? Nigga, you ain't you know how to hustle. Ain't nobody more got to hustle than a fiend. Yeah, that's true. Shit, you can that, yeah, I never understood that big that begging shit, dog. I seen uh shit, I seen that nigga life dog begging. Remember him? The, the big dude with the uh, dreads that you say I wear at the old crib. Uh, he used to sing and rap. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, seen that, that nigga outside begging and shit. I'm oh, like, damn, bro. Shit. No, you know who fucked me up still? Remember that nigga we went to school with? Oh, oh. short nigga. Um, he been hyped for a minute. Uh, I can't think of Name, but I really fuck with him because he's a break dancer. Uh, I can't think of his name, man. I'm like, God damn, nigga, you still out here? Mm. And I throw him a bag of chips and fucking dollar or whatever. Just fucking shit for me, he's a break dancer. I'm like, God damn, dog. Oh, oh, man, that's fucked up. That's fucked up, bro. <laughs> Like, man, when you, like, when, when you see motherfuckers just purposefully out there like that, you don't feel sorry for them. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody feel sorry for me when I was out there, and I wasn't even out trying to be out there. Right. And what happened is he was just talking from walking at that probably different level. Seeing his own shit. And uh, he was talking to me. He was like, listen, man, I'm like, wait a minute. Like, we both, like, I know you. I'm like, yeah. And I told da 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 So I'm like, yeah. We break this, that's what I'm getting with Right. I'm so like, God damn, dog. You still out here. At what point do you just sit there and be like, nigga, this ain't this shit ain't me. I'm still relatively young. Right. You know what I mean? Like, you can still. Right. Sitting around just begging motherfuckers for shit. I don't like, uh, ugh. At least provide a service. That's what the wise my tires. Why is my time, dog? I, I respect the motherfuckers that be out there and they be like, yeah, let me pump your gas for a dollar or something like that. I'm with it. Work for your high. <laughs> Work for your high. Bro, think about it. You just on the, on the like, you on 16th and National, uh, no, uh, Wisconsin, right? Mm-hmm. And you got, and you just sitting there with a mic. And the motherfuckers having a hard day at work. So in school, and you just sitting here just with a buck telling jokes and making motherfucking laugh, and niggas just throwing money in, and you earn this shit. Yeah, everybody, everybody can't tell jokes. jokes. You better find a way, cause as they ain't gonna do shit for you. Yeah, I mean, you ain't gotta tell jokes. You can do anything, whatever you but good you at. You know what I'm saying? Like singing. Let's see, I see a nigga. You can't have drums to me, but this nigga had a whole drum set. I can't go. <laughs> Work for your shit. Work for like be at the gas at your ass and get up on. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. 
I, uh, motherfuckers don't want to, uh, well, motherfuckers don't want to work no more. That's the problem, though. That's why it's like you got so many motherfucking jobs out here hiring now. These niggas don't want to work, though. That shit trash, dude. Like, oh, y'all just want to sit around and collect government money, huh? Like, that shit free. They're going to get that shit back in blood. Nigga. They already started with these gas prices, nigga. <laughs> like, we're going to get that stimulus check back. Right back. They're going to they gonna spend it all on gas. Oh, yeah. They get everything back. Everything. The fucking housing market is crazy. Gas is crazy. And motherfuckers think that we're going, oh, man, because it's monkey pop shit. They think I'm going back to the lockdown. Like, if we never going back to lockdown. Uh, how, 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 bad, how bad is that shit right now? It ain't even bad. I ain't seen nobody out here with a fucking monkey butt. Yeah, but according to the news, how bad is it? Because I ain't been watching. Oh, no, it's... It's, uh... What was the first variant of, um... COVID? Oh, COVID. I can't even remember. It's on that level. Shit, the first variant was fucked up. That ain't do shit. Delta, Delta. That ain't do shit. Oh, maybe a Marion. A Marion. A Marion. Nigga was fucking with the animal crime. That ain't fuck his fault. Yeah. Like, nobody gave a fuck. Like, we not shutting down. We we done. Life goes on, man. The monkey fight, nigga. The monkey fight, nigga. Right, right, we've already know, lost too much money and shit fucking around with y'all. Hey, y'all, when the shutdown is what, $800? You know what killed me, dog? I was watching the news one time and these motherfuckers were still, you know, after they uh lifted the mandate for a day and they brought it back. It was talking, I was watching some shit on the, on the, you know, the news. It was talking about, yeah, I think it's good to have a uh, mass mandate because, you know, some lady on there, she was like, you know, people cough and Stuff like that. I'm, I'm like, like, people cough. Like, you punk ass bitch. That ain't, ain't no good reason to fucking mandate mask. Motherfuckers is tired of that shit, dog. People, and, and people cough for all sorts of fucking reasons. Okay? They ain't gotta be COVID, motherfucker. Why your scary ass even leave the house in? Oh, I'm gonna go with that one. But sure. I ain't gonna lie, though. That winter was the first time I don't think I had the fucking flu enough. I don't think I, I don't even think I got sick. Yeah, I ain't either. I, I, I rarely get sick anywhere. But it, it was, I didn't like your feeling. It felt uh, just different. And it didn't feel social. And it didn't feel Yeah, because it wasn't social, nigga. We couldn't go out and do nothing, nigga. So I'm talking about even after, like, even when the mandate was lifted, that's bad. I'm thinking about it. When things start opening up. Yeah. It still felt kind of weird where you didn't want to be too close to nobody and I wasn't worried. I wasn't worried about that shit. I mean mean, just off the strip, like not having a man, you felt like fucking like you was gonna die type shit. That's ridiculous. And uh I don't know why we did uh my friend went to Florida and uh, everybody did a normal shit. And they is it's just Bunched up. And right. boy, I'm like, dog, I don't know this. Gonna be up and talk to people. Like, I miss that shit. So, I'm like, it's not shit, I'm Like, I'm not doing that shit no more. Fuck that. I'm done. Like, when they take that shit off the plane, I'm officially done. I'm officially done. Fuck that shit. On the real. Fuck that shit, man. We get to, if I get COVID, then I get COVID. Fuck it. Because I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get regardless. Right. There's nothing that I can do. And back to what you were talking about, if you so worried about COVID and all this shit, why the fuck are you even out the house? Right. Why are you out? You Stay your ass in the bubble, you bubble niggas, boy. You, <laughs> you niggas always come out here complaining about fucking COVID and oh, somebody's gonna die. Uh oh, COVID. Not a monkey pox going out, dog. Everybody don't get monkey pox. Bitch, like, I need to see you at the fucking club. Huh. I didn't see you post on Facebook and you was at the club with no ass. You gonna have monkey pox on your pussy. <laughs> like, it's like, bitch, you got herpes. It's a hypocrisy of all. Like, oh, you wear your mask all day. No, you don't, bitch. I just saw you. You was at the bar with me. I hated wearing my mask all day when I was in the kitchen and shit. That shit was annoying. It's all hot and shit. 
that. Fuck this shit. I do not want to be constricted by a piece of cloth. Shit, I can't barely breathe in this motherfucker. It's already hot as a bitch. Now I'm sweating under this punk ass mask. Yeah, most of the time, motherfuckers wearing it, wearing the hat ass, motherfucker down ass. That was me too. Shit, I ain't give a fuck. Cause you don't want to. I'm not gonna worry about it. You have to wear it. Yeah. You have to keep it on your face. That's all it is. Right. Like, fuck this shit. We over it, man. I'm over it, bro. Like, it'd be tripping me out when I still get bus drivers who try to tell me to put a mask on. It's very rare, but it happens. So you be very Get the fuck out of here, dog. You don't need that shit on the fucking lane no more. I can't wait. I hated that shit. I hated that shit. I hated it, dude. Like, especially when I was used to go to New York because. I gotta have the mask on on my Uber into the fucking airport. I gotta have the fucking mask on to the whole airport. I gotta have the fucking mask on to the whole fucking flight. I gotta have the fucking mask on to the train. I mean, the bus taking me to into the city. I gotta have the fucking train on. I mean, the mask on on the fucking train. Uh, subway taking me to my fucking hotel Uber. I mean, uh, or Airbnb. And then finally, seven hours later, I can take this bitch off. Get to put it back home and I'm out the street. Like, I don't. I'm done. I will smack you if you ask me about a mask. Uh-huh. <laughs> put your mask on, please, sir. Smack you, bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> uh, you nigga. What, what the, the fuck, fuck you gonna do, man? Yeah, put your, put your mask, mask on. on. Fuck you. Fuck off. Put your mask. Fuck. We went over. But it's over. It ain't 2020. We're done. We're back to normal. Back to business. Hopefully, yeah, for some people. A lot of motherfuckers had to shut, shut, shut down. down. Completely. Oh, damn. I had a fucking business call. Oh. Yeah. Some, some of them deserve to be, but fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's cruel. I'm joking. Um. Yeah. So, I'm having a conversation on uh motherfucking... Um, Punk ass social, social media, media Facebook, and uh, these hoes basically. All right, this bitch posted a status saying, um, some dude that works at that he don't date black women no more because they mean, right? And they uh, and they don't submit. So. I'm reading the comments on this motherfucker when I, when I first see it. And, uh, yeah, and I don't see nothing wrong that he said, but at the same time, you got bitches on here like, um, white women are not submissive either, don't let them fool you. You know, as if that's the only option. You know what I'm saying? You're either black or white. The, you know, no, Asians don't, don't exist. exist. Puerto Ricans don't, don't exist. Asian <laughs> couples. Oh yeah. Trust I know. They know how to act. But the thing you can't but, talk about that submission shit. He broke. Hold on one second. He she goes. Then another bitch said. Yes, we do, but not to him. He is not a lioness nor a leader. You know, right? You don't even know this nigga. They're, they just straight attacking this motherfucker just because they don't. It ain't something that they don't like. That's all it is. These bitches don't even have a nigga most of the time. On my life, they don't. Lying ass bitches, and they will make it so bad as it was some dudes on here too. Come on, man, show up. There's some dudes on here, dog. That's a lot of comments on this motherfucker all of a sudden. But yeah, man. What did I say about fucking Sims, though? Sims are worse than bitches. Because all they do is put a battery in his back. Well, this one nigga said, he pussy. And then the person who posted the shit said, maybe he wishes he had one. Like, why y'all gotta go there? Like, for one, this nigga don't know this motherfucker. Two, why y'all jumping on his back just because he got a motherfucking preference? As if bitches ain't got a preference. And so... Only women can get preference. Man, fuck that shit. Fuck what fuck what we like. Look, look. What he means is black women won't let him have his way with them. 
they won't just accept or submit to just anything and he is right we also don't care if men don't choose us especially if he isn't worthy of our love and strength bullshit y'all don't what do you think what do you think, what do you think all this fat shit and shit came from huh what do you think all this shit and shame and all this all this shit came from them who is who do you think you can pull this shit on them man they don't know no man. I know this shit. Y'all, anytime women don't like shit, get the fuck the pole. Straight up. Anytime they, 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 when some shit, yeah, when they don't like, when you, we don't like shit, they get easy to like, oh, like I said before, you know, like, I don't wanna, six foot six, nigga, uh, dark skin, muscle, da 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 da. Alright, cool. Alright, I want me a light skin, big, that's some men, and got to do that. Oh, what are you trying to say? Oh, just because you like my skin, what are you, what Darcy, you, you, stop. Uh, what, 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 what are you now? Skin phobic? I don't want to fucking say Skin phobic? Tone phobic. <laughs> you tone loco. <laughs> you know what I mean? But they, they just, they just. Hey, what they say, what they say on, uh, remember you said on black issues, like, you got that beige rage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, listen to this shit, dude. A black man can prefer light skin. But if a cop firm a lot of black male or white men, it's a problem. Both are making decisions based on color, skin color. So why is it wrong when the cop does it? It's All right. Die. All right. It's it's not based on skin color. It ain't got nothing to do with skin color. It's got to do with the way she look for one. You know what I'm saying? And two, her attitude. But if I like a white bitch, why can't I like a white, can I like a white bitch? Yeah. I mean. Whatever. I mean, shit. You like what you like. You know what I'm saying? They leave gay people alone, don't they? But here's my thing, though. Here's my thing. But then there's no backlash. But then there's backlash. Yeah, fuck a backlash. From where? The internet? Yeah, fuck that shit. You know what I'm trying to say. Yeah, fuck these niggas. Hey, like, fuck them niggas. I'm telling you, them niggas are the fucking worst. Because they always say this shit. To get validation, pat on the for women. Basically, they don't, don't agree this shit. They want to get, they want to get their Scooby snack. But they don't, but they know they don't agree this shit and call for it at the barbershop. But dog, that was a Paul saying like it was a Paul talking about um what was it? uh do do men like um do men like um stretch marks and. Church marks and uh, what is it? Fupas. What's, What's a fupa? That fat that bitches get right here when they put their stomach in their fucking thing. Ugh! No, hit me up! We deal with that shit to get to the pussy. Like, I. Exactly. Church marks, I, 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 I don't know what I feel. I fuck this bitch. Yeah, we I put up with that shit. But these niggas, these niggas was, was sitting here talking about. Ooh, 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 we love that shit. Nigga, when? We love stretch marks. Since when? I don't. That shit look gross. Since when, nigga? That shit look like a kangaroo pouch. Since when you been sitting around here in the barbershop and you sitting around here, nigga, you damn sure you fuck that shit. Nice ass stretch marks. Boy, that ooh, 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 that's why fat bitches get fucked and don't get white. I'm like, nigga love, nigga say all these people don't love this shit. But then you don't see these niggas all these bitches hands in public. They use you to fuck. That's it. Yeah. You ain't wrong with big, big chick. But don't sit there act like you only fuck with big chick. You fuck with big chick. You think that fat bitch online is gonna fuck you. That's it. Don't be, like, why can't niggas just be like, this? like, who, bro, I'm gonna have a fucking heart attack. Let me finish uh, reading this, some of these comments, man. No, it's going in. Check your heart rate and shit. Damn, bro. What is it? What is it? Oh, yeah, it ain't bad. 187. I'm turning into the Hulk and shit in a minute. Hell no, you're going to turn the hospital up. <laughs> okay, so that comment that I just read about the they don't 
find one that's worthy of our love and strength. I had to chime in, dog, eventually. You know what I'm saying? Because I just got tired of the whole echo chamber from the women and the men. You know what I'm saying? Normally, I would have just left it alone, but I was just reading that shit. It pissed me off. So I'm just like, you know what? Fuck it. I commented on that one. I was like, this is exactly what I mean. Conditional femininity. Oh, I'll submit to the right man. No, you won't. No, the fuck you won't. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's the... It's impossible. You're not going to submit because you're a masculine woman by nature. You know what I'm saying? That's who the fuck you are. You are combative. You are difficult. That's what in who you are. Embrace it and stop trying to lie to yourself and to men. Because men ain't going. We ain't stupid, dog. We, we, we see the shit. We see the shit. It's right in our fucking face. It's feminism. They have to be 24-7 Straight up. But y'all feel the need to fill our shoes. Like, you know, ain't nobody even asking you to do that shit, dog. Like, what the fuck? And you made a good point because then that's why you get women talking about you can't handle. Why the fuck I, why the fuck I gotta handle you, bitch? I don't handle women. I handle animals. I handle tarantulas. Shit, I, but the point is, I handle I handle animals. I don't handle women. I shouldn't have to handle a grown ass woman. And I shouldn't have to fucking go to war with you. You're supposed to be making life easier for me. Exactly. Why you being a fucking pain in my ass? Okay, now this motherfucking tr- This one kid. <laughs> that's because you was just moving, I guess. You know, it changes. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> that's not normal. But, all right, but this one got me hot. He was like, that's because he a clown ass, or like, he an ass clown and not worthy of submitting to. I'm like, you don't know this nigga. You don't even know him, dog. Apparently, a bitch find him worthy to submit to, or at least uh, that's what he looking for. At least he know what the fuck he want. You bitches don't even know what the fuck you ugly ass motherfuckers want. Bro, that's how it is online, man. I'm not kissing these old ass. You an enemy. Oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Look, Look at this, this echo chamber, chamber shit. Not an ass clown, sis. Next comment from the same bitch. I heard one, sis. With two fucking crying laughing emojis. Fuck you, bitch. And then I so I once again I chime in. Again, this is another example. Just straight disrespectful. Don't even know the nigga. All because he got a preference. Shaking my head. So what? What did they say to you? Uh, let me see. Oh shit! This one girl goes say, the one that posted the shit said he wished the whole black race of women away because of his own experiences. That ain't f- fair, bro. I'm like, uh, he ain't wait. He ain't wish him away. Why do females always go to these ridiculous extremes? He just said they're too difficult to date, so he don't date them. That is fair. Y'all y'all got preferences. Why can't you have any without getting shame for it? You know what I'm saying? And then this one bitch would say, uh, what the fuck she say? Oh, calm him down. Child, why let him get worked up? Truth hurt. What truth? You, you've yet to present any truth. Real ones don't have to justify their preference to downgrade. All right, first of all, who the fuck says he's downgrading because he's actually getting a woman that's ready, to, willing to get on his program? How is that a downgrade compared to a combative bitch like you? You know what I'm saying? Who, who, who you come home to, ain't nothing done, no dinner cooked, no respect. You know what I'm saying? No peace. You ain't even get peace in your own house. That's a problem. You need to cut that cancer out. Shit, for real. Like, not this. Facebook, 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 Facebook. Anytime, if I can say something they don't like, again, sign yeah, sign, sign language, language. shaming, insults, guilt, guilt, and the need to be right. Again, disrespectful for no reason. Every time y'all open y'all mouth, y'all prove this man right. That's what I said. You know what I'm saying? I pretty much. I didn't leave it alone, though. I, it was another batch of comments on another, you know, how they reply to certain comments and shit. I'm going to reply somewhere down here. I'm sure there's more bullshit somewhere. 
I was trying to explain to this bitch basically like there's a difference between I mean not a difference but I'm like because I said no that's how I started it off like I said no these bitches don't cooperate he right and then some bitch gonna say there's a difference between submitting and cooperating and I'm like okay so what's what is being submissive to you and you know, you know of course again they go to these big ass extremes uh, you give up your whole will and uh, the, to another person and it's like in a relationship it's not like that it's not like a dictatorship alright we're just saying like it's, it's levels to this shit so, you know, so when it comes to submission in a relationship and 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 like you gotta have that certain level of submiss of submission in you as a woman you gotta know your role as a woman in order to cooperate I'm trying to explain to this bitch like this shit go hand in hand are you kind of the same person who wants you to pay all the bills it's probably I don't know what the fuck these hoes want. The same woman wants you to pay all the bills. They probably don't, but if they do, they are. These are the same women. These are the exact same women who want you to pay all the fucking bills. Yeah, in a lot of cases, yeah, yeah you can't submit to a man that's paying all the fucking bills, but you'll submit to the motherfucking white man at your job. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. Yeah, even if he is. You better submit or you gonna get your ass kicked. <laughs> get in there and clean the motherfucking bathtub. I just bust a nut in the water. Got to drain that. Scrub it out with some Ajax. I ain't got no more gloves, so you know. <laughs> but yeah, dog, like, uh, I'm really trying to find the comment. Shit. Hey, yeah, I'm supposed to just sit here. And more uh, retro raging episodes coming soon. I thought I'm really been thinking about playing. Uh, what the fuck is that shit called? Uh, not Soul Caliber. Uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 2 again. Cause there's so many characters on there. I want to play with this shit on online and just get it, get that shit out of my system, man. Shit on the real. Just beat the shit out of somebody, or somebody beat the shit out of me. It's probably gonna be the latter. I bet you. I bet you. Cause it wouldn't be retro raging if I won. It'll be like retro. I don't know what the fuck. I wouldn't even know what to call it. Look at these fucking comments. Unbelievable. He wants a slave or a pushover. A man said this. A fucking man said that, man. I don't understand how many dudes need their ass kicked before they realize that they is putting pussy on a pedestal. That's a damn crying shame. Okay, okay. There's a man saying some stupid shit. I just said to the audience, he wants a slave or a pushover. That's not what we. That's not what that means to her. And of course, you know, the bitch is co-signing and ying 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 ying. Just saying, maybe it's just me. Shut up. Shit. Oh, here's another guy. It could be that black women, or the black woman or women he dated wasn't mentally stable, which may have left a bad taste in his mouth. At least that's a more reasonable response than he want a slave. But still, at the same time, it's more than just anecdotal experience. This is generally speaking. And when we say black, we talk about African-American women. What the fuck? Shit. All right. So let's just get that out the way. It's not that black women won't submit. He's not man material either and lacks. Wait, he can't spell. Lacks leadership for a black woman to submit. What? You should be submitting automatically. That should be in your nature as a woman. That's what the fuck you're trying to say. It shouldn't be on a condition that, oh, if the man is manly enough, then I'll submit to him. Well, if he ain't manly enough, why the fuck you with him? How about that? How about, right, that's the better question. Why the fuck you with him? If you, if you really don't feel like this man is worth your... Uh, letting him be a man and take leadership in this relationship, you feel you gotta take that role? Well, I'll fuck you with him. I'll fuck you with a beta bitch ass nigga. Resources. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically. I don't even see how they got them without being a 
a, a lion or a shark or whatever the fuck you, animal you want, a predatory animal. They'll probably put that shit on in the beginning. And they go back to the natural masculine ass fucking bullet. This bitch said that she was she was arguing with me. I'm trying to explain to her like let me, let me find my comment. Okay, I was I asked her what is, what does submission mean to you? Submission means to give up your will to the will of another. To cooperate means to work together. Now how is that the same? Because I was you know. I was uh, now I'm trying to explain to this bitch that in a relationship, I like, guess, in relationships they go hand in hand. Big part of cooperation is knowing your role. All right, black women have been trying to be the man of the relationship for so long that they don't even realize that it's detrimental to the relationship. They don't know. They don't realize that it's unattractive and unladylike. Hell, a lot of them don't even realize that they're doing it. But knowing your role as a man or woman is imperative when it comes to cooperation. The, the people that's working together got to be on the same page as far as who does what. Otherwise, the plan is going to fall to shit. And there's got to be a leader in every team. But that's why it came back to the whole paying the bills thing. What they want? They want cooperation with power. Yeah, it don't work like that. But when it comes to actual doing shit, as far as gender roles, they want that shit also. So they want to kick in 82. They want, they want you to pay all the bills, but they also want to call shots too. Yeah, it, I mean, so you can call some shots, but shit, not, not that many. I'm like, when you pay all the bills, I'm calling the shots. Oh, all I'm the like, bills. I'm like, okay. You all that. Fuck that. We got quote right now. I'll pay the bills. I'm the fucking judge. The jury execution. <laughs> I'm calling everything. I'm fucking QB. Fuck bitch, that. I that paid for that wig you wearing, bitch. Fuck that. That wig I pulled, I pulled off last night, night, bitch. Fuck that. That's what I'm talking about. That cooperation shit, that's for power. Like, oh, I will listen to you, maybe, but also you paying these bills. Because that's what my daddy did in 1954. I think we're motherfucking 1954. Fuck out of here. Yeah, and I'm saying, and I'm trying to explain to this dumb bitch that people have, what I'm trying to say is that people forgotten their roles. Y'all not submissive, so therefore y'all cannot cooperate with a man. It's impossible. You know what I'm saying? Like, you really can't. Cause I, <laughs> you know, you're working against them. If you're not working with them, especially in, a, in certain situations. Yeah, but now we also think that there's a lot of women who, who feel like they can just do it by themselves. So they like, They're gonna end up doing it by themselves. Yeah, but they're thinking about, excuse me, they're thinking, why, why the fuck should I have to? Have, have to, to do what? Do it by themselves? No, why the fuck should I have to stick to you? Oh, yeah, exactly. That, but that's what I'm saying. If you got a man that you don't even fucking respect, why are you with him? And I said resources. Yeah. That's why the beta simp get the bitches when they island prime. Oh, bums. Uh, Why bitches is point, bums. And the dudes is bums too, man. And after that point, that's when they look for that thing. And so she argues, after I said that, I cooperate with a man every day. Several, wait, several at that because we're on common ground to achieve something. But submit, no, not a until he can show me, me he's worthy i will not give up my free will for him and lead me wait for him to lead me all kind of ways but the right way like shut your ass up like seriously so how the fuck you got it's not like a business transaction to me business relationship so that don't count that's not what the fuck i'm talking about at that point i was just pretty much done responding i see it was yeah. Yeah, I don't talk to women, dog. Uh, they they are not worth my they are not worth my conversation. Um, obviously, this bitch is not intelligent enough to understand what I was trying to tell her. Either that, or she saw it and she just decided to ignore it. If this women are wired to hear what the fuck they want to hear, yeah. When other dudes are telling them what they want to hear, what is when to listen to anything different? Straight up. <laughs> Right up. They, 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 they feed off validation. That's, that's why I hate Because even if you don't agree with it, you have to make a 
and making her feel good on shit that you don't even really agree with. And all that is to beat her fucking ego and her validation and all the shit that she know don't make no fucking sense. And you know don't make no motherfucking sense. And it's fucked up because, you know, they feed off all that validation because they're not, women aren't inherently confident. Of course not. You know what I'm saying? They, they, which leads us into our fucking topic. The main topic of the day is the topic at hand, as I call it. Do women hate themselves? And when I say women, I'm, I mean, we're speaking in general, but we're, we're going to be mostly talking about black women because that's mostly what we deal with. It's mostly what we see in our day to day lives. So, um, yeah, I mean, how can I put this? I think a lot of them really do. Like, a lot of them just really, like like I said, they're not inherently confident. It takes about 40 to 50 dudes for them to get, you know what I'm saying? They head swelled up enough to the point where they think they the shit. They don't just automatically think they the shit. It's the dudes that be, you know what I'm saying? Pressing the issue or the simps or the simp masters. Well, that's why I disagree. I think Didn't you just get done saying that? What? What I just said? No, but they, they hate themselves, not these dumb, not now. Only the, for the reason you just said, because this is the perfect, this is the most um, self esteem women, especially since they ever had. Because of social media validation, what you, you got sims telling her what they want to hear. You got chicks in there who showing them, oh, I love your fucking gut, I love your fucking scars, I love all this shit. Validation, 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 validation. Mm-hmm. There's no, there's no, there's nobody in there telling them, uh, uh bitch, you fat, or you this, or you that. And if you do, you get hit with people who are going to defend you from fucking all over the place. So there's no, there's really, unless it's, the way to me, the women that hate themselves more are the old bitches who see themselves, who think about the time they could have had anybody, any dude, the top dude, back in their prime, back when they were 21, 22, 23, and now they see what their life has become. The fact you're old, you ain't got nobody, you got five fucking kids. You're black, you're poor, you're <laughs> ugly, <laughs> you're woman, you're nothing at all. Them the bitches that hate themselves off of the fact that they knew they blew it. And now they, they now they sit at home and look at themselves in the fucking mirror every day and know they ain't shit no more. Oh yeah, of course. And it feels great. That feel good. Uh, I think I think these young chicks do too, man. These young chicks no fucking way. Yeah, they do. Too too many. Too many. It's too many whores out here. It's too. It ain't making money. All who said. It's too. It's the val. It's too much validation. They they. Always. But what woman that what 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 woman that actually love themselves would pick a profession like that? Or, or respect they sell. No, I'm just. It, people become millionaires without doing that, though. So, why would they have to pick that profession if they really love themselves? If you can make $100,000 a week and you ain't got to fuck nobody. Bro, it's a self respect thing. Bro, I'm not going to lie. 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 I'm not going to it's the same shit. They don't give a fuck. They know this motherfuckers on pay. They don't care because what I say, this is a different era. There's no shame in that shit no more. These bitches will tell you they hold. They will literally tell you. It, it, the fuck is this? We living in a um, the whole we live in the whole society now. Bitch was easily tell you they a fuck five niggas yesterday, and there's nothing. They, you know what? That don't mean it's okay. okay. I'm that's not, not, that's, that's not, not the point. point. That is the point. They don't, it's too much validation for them to have hate. Hey, they Back in the day, back in the day, oh, they cook. They cook. 
always free, but these days, you know it's